Good morning, praying parents. It's another day. And the Lord is saying to you this morning, my grace is sufficient for you. My grace is sufficient for you. No matter what you're going through, my grace is available and well sufficient to meet you at your point of need. I want us to say thank you to Jesus this morning that he's given us the spirit of grace. I want you to say, Father, I thank you for the spirit of grace. Thank you that you have apportioned me grace in these difficult times. Thank you that your grace is sufficient for me and my family. Give him praise this morning. Say, Father, I thank you. Lord, I give you praise. Lord, I worship you. Lord, I magnify your name for you are good and there is none like you. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for availability of your love, for your loving kindness. I am grateful. Give him thanks this morning. Thank you, almighty God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Father, we give you praise this morning. We magnify your holy name. Give him praise, give him praise, give him praise. It's a new day. Say, Father, I give you praise. I give you glory. I magnify your name. I exalt your name. I praise you for who you are. You are wonderful. You are glorious. You are marvelous. You are great. You are beautiful. There is none like you. I worship you this morning. Hallelujah, Jesus. This is the day that you have made. I rejoice and I am glad in it. Thank you for making this day available. Give him praise, give him praise. Thank him. Thank him for this day. Thank him for this week. Thank him for the rest of this year. Say, Father, I thank you. Oh, Rabaka Yalamaka Seke Talababa. I thank you. Male Mare Maka Yalamaka Seke Talababa. I give you praise. I give you glory. I magnify your holy name. Thank you for this week. Thank you for this day. Thank you for this hour. Do you know he's got great plans for your children? He's got great plans for you. But the enemy always comes in the midst. The enemy comes to seek, to destroy, to steal. Yeah, to steal, to kill, to destroy. But the Lord said that I have come that you may have life and have it more abundantly. We give praise to God for life. We thank God for abundant life. We thank him for his mercy. We thank him for his grace that is sufficient. Say, Father, I thank you for your grace that is sufficient for me as a parent. Thank you for your grace in the times of challenges, in challenging times. I give you praise for your grace. I thank you that your grace carries me with my family, my children. The huge responsibility that you carry, the grace of God is sufficient for you. Hallelujah, Jesus. Masela makashaka. Masela makaraba kaseke tala makayala makaseke. Maseke tala makayala makaseke. Maseke tala makayala makaseke. Maseke tala makara makaseke tala baba. Father, we give you praise. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for the children. I thank God for your children praying parents. Masela makayala makaseke. No weapon fashioned against your children shall prosper. I commit their weak into the hands of God. I commit your weak into the hands of God. Mare mashakatala makaseke. No weapon fashioned against your children, against their weak against your weak shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we give you praise. I want you to thank him for fruitfulness in your week. Say, Father, I thank you that my week will be fruitful in the name of Jesus. Say, Father, I thank you that my children's week will be fruitful in the name of Jesus. I command fruitfulness into your week, into your children's week in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we thank you for fruitfulness. Yes, Lord. Thank you for fruitfulness. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. 
we give you praise that our children bear fruit. Yes, Lord Jesus, Mazama Kalamakasiki. We bear fruit in the mighty name of Jesus. Mazema Remagaya Kalamakasiki. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. We bless you. 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 Bless him. Bless him. Bless the Lord. The Bible says, Bless the Lord, O my soul. And all that is within me, bless his holy name. Say, Lord, I bless you. I bless you. I bless you. I praise you. I worship you. I bless you. I bless you. I worship you. I thank you. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Masala bakashiki. Masala bakashiki. Masala bakashiki. Marabagazeke talababa. Marabagazeke talababa. Marabagazeke talababa. Yes, Lord. Maze, 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 maze. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Father, we give you praise. We give you glory. We magnify your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name we're praying. Amen, amen, and amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. In Leviticus chapter 26, verses 3 to 4, the Bible says, If you walk in my statutes and keep my commandments so as to carry them out, then I shall give you rains in the season. The Lord did not say, I shall give you rain. He says, I shall give you rains, R-A-I-N-S, in the season, so that the land will yield its produce and the trees of the field will bear fruit. I pray over you and your children that the Lord God of Israel shall give you rains in this season. The Lord shall give you rains in this season so that your land will yield its produce and the trees of the field will bear their fruit. You will bear fruit. Your children will bear their own fruit. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Your land will yield its produce. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. In the same Leviticus chapter 25, 18 to 19, the Lord says, you shall thus observe my statutes and keep my judgments so as to carry them out, that you may live securely on the land. When we obey God, security is automatic. Praise the Lord. Then the land will yield its produce so that you can eat your fill and live securely on it. You will eat your fill. Your children will eat their fill and you will live securely. In the mighty name of Jesus, I want you to say, Father, I will eat my fill in the land that you've given me. I will eat my fill. I will bear fruit. My children will bear fruit. We will live securely on the land that you've given us. Whatever nation you live in, you will live securely. You will bear fruit there. You will eat your fill. In the name of Jesus, your children will eat their fill. Your family will eat their fill. Wherever you live, the Lord will provide for you. You don't need to move to Canada. You don't need to move to anywhere. You just need to stay where you are and obey God's statutes and keep his judgments and carry them out. And the Bible says you will live securely on the land. Oh, Rabba Kashaka Talababa, I plead the blood of Jesus over you and your children that you will live securely on your land. You will live securely in your nation. Your children will live securely wherever they are. In the mighty name of Jesus, they will eat their fill. You will eat your fill in that land. In that land, you will bear fruit in the name of Jesus. I command fruitfulness in your children's lives, in your life, in the name of Jesus. Rabba kaseke talababa, lebra makashaka talababa. Yes, Lord. Mase 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 mase. La bara baga zege talababa baba. La bara maga zege talamama mama. Ala makaya la makasheke. La makara makaseke. The Lord will bless you. The Lord will bless you. He will not only bless you and and give you your fill, but He will make you secure on your land. In the mighty name of Jesus, your tree will yield its fruit. In the mighty name of Jesus, your land will yield its increase. Your family will yield its increase. Your family will yield its fruit. And your family will yield its increase. Your children will yield their fruits. And they will yield their increase. You will yield your fruit. And you will yield your increase. In the mighty name of Jesus. Masala makashaka talamakaseki. Lamakala makasheke talamakaseki. Makatala makara makaseki. Makatala makaseke talababa. Yes, Lord. Father, we give you praise. We give you glory this morning. 
in the mighty name of Jesus. And God is saying that they will know that I am the Lord when I have broken the bars of their yoke and have delivered them from the hand of those who enslaved them. The enemy wants to enslave you, enslave your children, enslave your family. But God says that I have broken the bars of their yoke. Every yoke is broken and I have delivered them from the hand of those who enslaved them. Ezekiel 34. 27 and also the tree of the field will yield its fruit and the earth will yield its increase and they will be secure on their land then they will know that I am the Lord when I have broken the bars of their yoke and have delivered them from the hand of those who enslave them I want you to thank the Lord right now for deliverance and say father thank you that you have delivered my family you have delivered my children from the hand of those who enslaved us. There is no more slavery for you. There is no more slavery. There is no more profitless hard work. Oh, mama, mama, sheke. There is no more poverty for you. In the name of Jesus, I decree and I declare fruitfulness over you. Your land, your family will yield its fruit. The earth in your home will yield its increase. In the name of Jesus, you will increase in your job. You will increase in your marriage. You will increase. Yeah, your children will increase. They will profit in the name of Jesus. They will be secure on their land. You will be secure on your land in your family. Your family will be secure wherever you go. I plead the blood of Jesus over you. Yes, Makalamakaseki. I want you to say, Father, I thank you that you have broken the bars of our yoke. You have broken it. You have broken the bars of our yoke. You know, the enemy does not only yoke. Yeah, he, he puts the bar in place. So that you can't come out of that problem. So that you can't come out of the situation. He tries to buy you in. But God has broken the bars of your yoke. I want you to say, Father, I thank you that the bars of my yoke is broken. The bars of my children's yoke, they are broken in the name of Jesus. You have delivered us. Thank you for deliverance. From the hand of those who enslaved us, you have delivered us. From profitless hard work, you have delivered us. From slavery to infirmity to sickness. You have delivered us from lack. You have delivered us. Thank you for delivering us in the name of Jesus. Thank you that the bars of our yoke is broken. Broken. Broken in the name of Jesus. Thank him right now. Say, Father, I thank you that the bars of my yoke, they are broken. The bars of my children's yoke, they are broken. You have delivered us. We thank you. Thank you for deliverance. Thank you for deliverance over my children's lives. Come on. Yes, Lord, if your child is on drugs, that child is free. The yoke is broken. If they're struggling, the yoke is broken. If they're rebellious, the yoke is broken. Your children are fruitful. Your family are fruitful. They are fruitful. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord Jesus. Father God, thank you. Give him praise, give him praise, give him praise. Father, we give you praise. We thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Almighty God. In Jesus' mighty name. We pray, amen, amen, and amen. In Zechariah chapter 8, verse 12, the Bible says, For there will be peace for the seed. There will be peace for the seed. This is a word for somebody. There will be peace for your seed, for your children. Your children are your seed. For there will be peace for your seed. This is a word that you must take. You must write it down. Zechariah 8, 12 and you begin to confess it. That at Lord, I stand on Zechariah 8, 12 over my son, over my daughter, over my grandchildren. For there will be peace for them. There will be peace for, for, for them. There will be peace for Tony. There will be 
peace for Adrian. There will be peace for Bumi. There will be peace for Shola. There will be peace. There will be peace. There will be peace for Jude. There will be peace for June. In the name of Jesus, there will be peace for your children, praying parents. In Jesus' mighty name, I want you to speak it right now and mention your children's names and say, Father, I decree according to Zechariah 8, 12, that there will be peace for my seed. There will be peace for my children. There will be peace for my marriage. There will be peace in my home. There will be peace in my job. There will be peace all around my family. In the name of Jesus, thank him right now and say, Father, thank you for your peace. For there is peace for us. In the name of Jesus, thank you for your peace. Thank you for your peace. Thank you for your peace. The child that was troublesome is now peaceful. In the name of Jesus, the marriage that was turbulent is now peaceful. Yes, Lord, the children that are troublesome are now peaceful. In the name of Jesus, your job is now peaceful. In the name of Jesus, your life is now peace is now peaceful. In the name of Jesus, your week is peaceful. Your children's week is peaceful. The rest of this year is peaceful. The rest of your life and your children's lives, your lives are peaceful. In the name of Jesus, I want you to thank the Lord and say, Father, thank you that I lives are peaceful. Thank you that our homes are peaceful. Our week is peaceful. Yes, Lord. I speak peace over your week in the name of Jesus. Father, thank you that there will be peace in every aspect of our lives in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. The Bible says the vine will yield its fruit. The land will yield its produce and the heavens will give their due. And I will cause the remnant of these people to inherit all these things. God has got things in store for you. You're going to bear fruit. Your vine will yield its fruit. The land, your home will yield its produce. And the heavens will give their due. And the Lord will cause you and your children to inherit all these things. I want you to thank the Lord right now and say, Father, thank you that we're yielding fruit in our jobs. We're yielding fruit. My children are yielding fruit in their education. They are fruitful in their education. They yield fruit in their lives. They yield fruit in wherever they are. They are yielding fruits right now. This is your inheritance. The Lord says it will cause you to inherit all these things. So thank the Lord for fruitfulness. And then your land will yield its produce. Thank the Lord for production in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We bless you. And the heavens will give their due. The heavens will give their due over your children, over your family, over your home. In the mighty name of Jesus. And the Lord says, I will cause you, the remnant of these people, to inherit all these things. Hallelujah, Jesus. There shall be no dryness in your home. There shall be no unfruitfulness in your home. You shall be fruitful. Your lives shall be fruitful. Your jobs shall shall be fruitful. Your finances, you shall be fruitful. Your children shall be fruitful. In their education, they are fruitful. In their studies, they are fruitful. In their exams, they are fruitful. In their universities, they are fruitful. In their colleges, they are fruitful. At school, they are fruitful. In the name of Jesus, they are fruitful. Your children are fruitful. You are fruitful. Your family are fruitful. I want you to mention your children's names and mention them and decree that Lord, I decree. Uh, yes, that Tesha is fruitful. I'm decreeing over Tesha. You decree over your son. Over your daughter. I decree Tesha is fruitful. You mention your children's names right now. I decree Tesha is fruitful. In the name of Jesus. Masala. The heavens will give their due over Tesha. In the name of Jesus. For there will be peace over Tesha. According to Zechariah 8.12. In the name of Jesus. Tesha will yield his fruit. Your daughter will yield her fruit. Your sons will yield their fruit. Your family will yield their fruit. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. 
We give you praise. We give you glory. We magnify your holy name. Thank you, almighty God. We bless you. Praying parents, the Lord loves you. The Lord loves you. The Lord is passionate about you. He is so passionate about you. No weapon fashioned against you can prosper. Trust me, honestly, I'm telling you right now. I feel the passion of the Holy Spirit all around me. He says, I've wrapped myself. I've, I've wrapped, sorry, I've wrapped myself around the praying parents. I've wrapped myself around their children and no weapon fashioned against them can prosper. It cannot prosper. If God is for you, who can be against you? Nobody, nobody. And so I want you to rejoice in the knowledge that God loves you so much. He loves your children so passionately. Yeah, he said the kingdom of heaven. He said, suffer the little children to come unto me. For unto them belong the kingdom. The kingdom belongs to your children, belongs to your family. Praise the Lord. We thank God for inheritance. You will be fruitful in the mighty name of Jesus. I decree and I declare. Deuteronomy 6 to 10. Uh, I decree and declare Deuteronomy chapter 6 verses 10 to 11 over you and your family. And so shall it be when the Lord your God brings you into the land of which he swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give you large and beautiful cities which you did not build, houses full of all good things which you did not fill, hewn out wells which you did not dig, vineyards and olive trees which you did not plant. I decree this over you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen, amen, and amen. Go ahead and have a mightily fruitful week in Jesus' name. Your children are already blessed. Your seed are blessed. Your seed are blessed. There will be peace for your seed in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. God bless you, praying parents. May the Lord continue to keep you in Jesus' name. Wherever you are, you're safe and secure in the hands of Almighty God. There shall be no kidnapping around you. There shall be no evil around you. I bind accidents on the road. I bind accidents in the air. I bind accidents in the sea. There shall be no freak accidents around you in the mighty name of Jesus or around your children. In Jesus' mighty name, it is already well with you and we give praise to Almighty God. There is peace for your seed and there is peace for you. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you and have a wonderfully fruitful week. In Jesus' name, amen, amen. For those of you online, we meet at 9 p.m. UK time. 9 p.m. UK time tonight. In Jesus' name, bless you. God richly bless you in Jesus' name, amen. <music>